Hello everyone. So first part of the question says that if at its current production level, a perfectly competitive firm's marginal revenue and log minus run marginal cost are equal to $0.50 and its log minus run average cost is $0.35. Which of the following statements is true? So for a competitive industry, The MR curve, MC curve and price are same. In the long run, the produce at the point where the average cost is equal to price. That is, if the average cost is more in the long run, the firms will be facing a profit and if average cost is less, then the firms will be uh, then uh, if average cost is less than the price and more firms will come in and the price of the product will decrease. So answer is option A that says the firm should expect the market price of its product to fall. The second part of the question says that If the market price is $4 and a perfectly competitive firm is producing 3200 units and the marginal cost to produce the 3200 unit is $3.88, which of the following is true? So option D is true. That is the firm. should increase the production to increase the profit. In a perfect market condition, the price of the product is equal to the MC if less the firm can expand the production to the level where the price is equal to the marginal cost. Coming to the last part of the question that says in a perfectly competitive market an increase in the market demand will shift the perfectly competitive firms dash curve and dash. So Option D is correct. That is, will shift demand curve upward. That is, for a competitive firm, the price if the uh, the firm, the price is the demand curve. So if the market demand rises, the price will rise and the demand curve will shift upward. 